Does love count? <laughs> Which a mathematician should not do. We don't um, deal with real numbers. Think of that. Okay. Real numbers, yes. Okay. Quiet in the audience. Cartan, Cartan determinant conjecture and its converse. That's not a word. <laughs> of course it's a word. And unless I'm very much mistaken, the great Dr. Walter Burgess proved it a rather useful one. <clears throat> While doing calculations, a man like Walter Burgess just keeps on doing math until a theory soon emerges. And then he gets the notion that he'd better write it down. The weirdest words you ever heard, and this is how they sound. Oh, cart and determine and conjecture and its converse. Even though you're thinking that it simply couldn't sound worse. Walter makes it easy and you'll never have a math curse. Cart and determine and conjecture and its converse. Um the little um the um the um the um the But it doesn't mean anything. <laughs> Ask Walter Burgess what it means. He's a ring theorist and he made those words up. <laughs> Stone Age men did math, simply counting would suffice. Though they'd heard ring theory, they'd have used though if they'd heard ring theory, they'd have used it once or twice. I'm sure Egyptian pharaohs would have grasped it in a gif. Then every single pyramid would bear this hieroglyph. Oh, oh. isomorphism problem for finite dimensional diagrams. Say it loud and animals will simply want to run and scram. And though most of us common folks don't really even give a damn. Isomorphism problem for finite dimensional diagram. <laughs> could have carved it on their mighty monolith. The ancient Greeks, I'm certain, could have used it in their myth. I'm sure the Roman Empire only entered the abyss because those Latin scholars never did their math like this. <laughs> Using quasi-stratified algebra that Louis and Piquet are certainly enough to make you break into a sweat. It seems as though ring theory is as tough as it can get. Quasi-stratified algebra of Louis and Piquet. Oh, I'm the little, 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 of course, you can say it backwards, which is I can't in Louis algebra stratified quasi. <laughs> she may be tricky, but she's bloody good. <laughs> oh, if you've lost your pencil and you've got to do some math, just call on Walter Burgess and your background route the right path. He'll show you self injected simple piercies and such things as generalizations of quasi hereditary rings. Oh, homological aspects of semi group rings on rings. Don't even try to tell yourself that there is no such thing. A theory such as this one, Walter Burgess is the king. Homological aspects of semi group rings on rings. Um, <laughs> <laughs> the injective hall of assets, SSME lattice of groups. Go ahead and Google it, yes, Google till you droop. If you haven't heard of it, you're sure not in the loop. The injective hall of assets. As the semi lots of group so <laughs> the end metric completion of regular rings, the commutative on commutative on Newman and the joy such theory brings. And once you really delve right in, you'll feel like you have wings. The end metric completion of regular rings, oh <laughs> of the famous Walter Burgess! <laughs> <laughs>